So after watching all of this, if you're still asking why you should vote for me, <laughs> I think you could sum it up in one word, experience. I have prepared myself ever since leaving office as a volunteer serving on committees to be able to be prepared to help serve Provo. I've always had Provo's best interests at mind. I've always been able to balance the needs of our neighborhoods with the needs of our businesses and the needs of our vision and looking forward. So more than any other candidate in this race, I have the experience. And I'm so grateful that all of these other candidates are running and that they have the same desire to contribute back to Provo. My experience in preparation has um, been pretty extensive and some of these other candidates are just beginning, but we need them. We need them to come and contribute what they can to Provo and to be part of that and to prepare and to get the kind of experience that I've gained over the last several years so that they're prepared to lead in the future. Join me. Come be part of my campaign. Come be part of this experience of working together so that Provo can move towards the future that our children, that our grandchildren deserve and that is, is exciting for us without losing the charm of our sense of community together. So uh, if you want to engage with me on, uh, in this campaign, you can go to my website at sherryhalleverett.com. You can always find me on Facebook. I'm there quite often and I respond quickly. I have a page there called Sherry Hall Everett for Provost Mayor. And you can find me there and be sure to friend me as a friend because I, I love having, uh, being able to connect with you that way. I'm on Instagram, Sherry Hall Everett is my, uh, is my Instagram handle. And I'm just going to throw a little plug in. I, I'm a gardener. I love to garden. And I have a little Instagram called uh, Sherry's Garden. Uh, we've got 22,000 followers from around the world. And it's just pictures of my garden. Um, but you can, you can check that out too, because that's another aspect of myself that I don't, that people don't really get because of my public service. So I'll just throw that one in there. And then I'm on Twitter, but not completely. So. <laughs> So you can find me in those areas. Give me a call on the phone if you have a question. Send me an email. But, but get involved in this campaign. Learn about the issues. And hire somebody as your mayor for what Provo needs next.